Welcome to the Beyond Leadership Podcast, where we host outstanding individuals and we discover new dimensions of leadership and their talents and recipes for success. This is our 47th audio tip of the week. Here are some fun facts about number 47. Did you know that 47 pounds is about the same weight as 21 kilograms? 47 is also the calling code assigned to Norway. And for those of you who watched Agent 47, the movie, it's a protagonist of the Hitman video game series. And silver has the atomic number of 47. Today's tip of the week is based on the article Critical Thinking is about asking better questions, written by Coleman, published in April 2022 in Harvard Business Review. No matter your position, Critical thinking, the ability to effectively break down and analyze an issue to find a solution, will be core to your success. And at the heart of critical thinking is the ability to formulate effective questions. For effective questioning, start by holding your hypothesis loosely. Be willing to fundamentally reconsider your initial conclusions and do so without defensiveness. Here are a few ways to boost your ability to do so. Number one. Hold your hypothesis loosely. Good questions can lead you to fundamentally reconsider your initial assumptions, but you have to be willing to do so without defensiveness. Number two, listen more than you talk. Active listening allows you to fully grasp another point of view, making it easier to question your own assumptions and biases. Number three, leave your queries open-ended. Avoid asking yes or no questions. Instead, try to get the respondent to open at length. Number four, consider the counterintuitive. Every group needs someone who is unafraid to challenge the status quo in case you do need to change course. And final, number five, sleep on it. A good night's rest can actually help your brain see a problem more clearly. While we don't need to ask a litany of whys to get the heart of critical thinking, we should ask thoughtful, even hard, follow-up questions. It requires energy to listen hard and formulate those follow-ups, and that's often the only way to deepen your critical understanding of a topic. Critical thinking is at the heart of solving complex problems in a new and exciting way. Building these key skills will help you as you navigate new positions, new roles, establish yourself in your organization, or simply face a conundrum. Learn to formulate and ask questions rather than simply answering them. Now, do you practice critical thinking? What methods do you use? This was this week's tip of the week. Make sure to subscribe and follow us on all podcast channels like Spotify, Apple, Google, CastBox, and also follow us on YouTube, LinkedIn, Instagram, and Facebook. And we have a fantastic website, beyondleadership.si. Till next time.